How do we make it work? Um, I'd say through uh, uh, just a lot of support through the years, um, both supporting each other and, um, and I think involvement in the HIV community. Um, he's done AIDS marathons. I did the uh, AIDS life cycle in California where you ride a bike from San Francisco to Los Angeles to raise money. I've worked in the AIDS business for most of my adult life. So I think through, uh, we have a big a network of people who support us and um, that way we're able to support each other. I think there is a, ch there is a challenge um, in terms of trying to disconnect things from my personal life. Um, I think that my husband is very self-sufficient with his medications and I, I try not to get too involved with, with what he's doing in terms of his health care. He's, he's pretty on top of things. I think if he weren't, I might be more um, proactive in, what, in like asking what he was doing. But I think in a sense for me, there, I think there's a little bit of a protective thing for me and that I, I feel like I need to take a step back and let someone else handle his health care and not be so involved myself. It's a little close to home, I guess, since I'm also doing that professionally. Uh, he's just a very loving and accepting person. And, um, and, I, and I, I feel that from him, that he just you know, uh, loves me with all his heart. So that allows me to relax and love him back.